Hello. I don't know what to say. Really. It's been so long since I've done this. I'm not really much of a YouTuber or gamer type. But, uh... Well, here we are again. So today we are playing Kerbal Space Program, a game that allows you to launch little green frogs into space, using the weirdest rockets ever imaginable. Ones that even the Russians would look at and say, that's not safe. So I started a new science save, which is better than career or sandbox. I mean, like, sandbox is fun, but you don't progress in it, and career is just complete bullshit that I don't understand. So let's get started, shall we? Okay, so our first test craft, so our first spacecraft will be named Space Dummy 1. Or just Space Dummy. Yeah. With all the new visual updates, and plus they're trying to update it because, you know, this game's gonna have to compete with its sequel that it's coming out with. Okay, put a parachute because, like I always do, plus I don't want anybody dying on this. Mm, some wings, make it look cool. Yeah, there we go. Look at those. Beautiful. Wait, before. Mmm, that, that, that's more amazing. Okay, and then some science containers. There we go. And, make sure the staging's right. And then we save it. And now, it's for the fun part. Launching. I've been doing college, off and on. Uh, I'm in my second year, my freshman year. And, uh, yeah. Other than that, it's not really much going on. And, uh, it's time for us to launch. Okay, so, five, four, three, do not screw the countdown. One. There we go. My little jib there is getting all shaken up. Okay, and then we do one right in there. Okay, try to angle it over towards the sea. Well, we've made it. I think we can observe it again. Nah. Okay. Uh, time to finish it. pretty much safe at this point, so let me continue what I'm saying. My life's been going okay. I haven't posted much videos. Uh, I finally got my 11th subscriber. That's uh, pretty cool. So I'm officially a honorary small YouTuber. Uh, that's um, mostly it. I still haven't been monetized. I don't think I ever will. And I don't really want to. Watch it. Oh shit, what the fuck? God damn. What the fuck did you just fucking do? Oh Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jeb, Jeb. Oh thank god. God damn it, Jeb. Well, thankfully, everybody's okay at this point. And most of the buildings haven't exploded. Let's try to observe it again. Nah. Speed up a little bit of time. And... Things <laughs> still off the best time. Okay, and we can recover the vessel now. Space geek like I am. 
Oh, we got a little silencer. Now we can finally upgrade the rocket. Bada boom, and bada boom. Can't afford any of those, so time for us to leave. We've seen everything. Okay, and this craft shall be named um, Space Space Dingus. Space Dingus. Space Dingus. Mach 1. There we go. Put a parachute on, just to make sure. Coupler. Don't have any thermal, so we can't really go orbital now. So, if you guys are wondering why I like this game so much, it's because I'm trying to get into the aerospace industry. It's some. And that's what I'm trying to go for college for. I'm trying to be an aerospace engineer. More specifically, an aeronautical engineer. Or astronautical. It means I deal more with spacecraft. This game's right up my alley. Okay, put some fins on this. Mmm, perfect. Any couple? Ah, uh, just a minute. Okay, well. I. I, I think this thing will blow up. Well, let's see. Okay. Well, there we go. Space Dingus is right here, right on the pad. And five, four, three, two, one. We land it, so we land in the ocean. And then we go retrograde. Turn this sucker around, and there we go. We're officially safe. See you later, space dingus. Hopefully, it doesn't fall into fishermen. I don't see no boats. Well, we're doing better than well, we're doing better than this in that regard. <laughs> I sure do hope none of that pollutes the waters. Well, what are we talking about? We don't care. Okay, then speed it up a bit. I am doing. And we are visually safe. Do you have a little bit more? And don't worry about that splash exam, that was normal, that was completely normal. Nothing to see here. Warning, hatch may open. Well, I sure hope not. And kaboom! Right onto the ocean, nice and soft. EVA report, take a surface sample. And climb back in. Now we can finally get some more science done. And... Badaka boom. One. Okay, and all we could get was one. I'll have to save it for that because it has heat shields. I think we'll just use... Modify the space thing just a little bit. Space thing is marked two. Space thing is marked two. Okay, pull that out. You don't need that. Need a couple bigger fuel tanks. Excuse me. And put in that one. That one has the most thrust. And. Three, four. What the hell are you doing right there? Alright, just my mom, and probably my grandma and my little sister just watching something. 
Okay, and Dingus Mach 2 is starting to look a lot more like a Dingus and la less like a damn sausage. Okay, now we can start it up and... Let me see. Oh, we can start doing that. Let's count them. Let's get some temperature around the world. Yeah, let's override it. I'm pretty damn sure. And you launch. And now it's time for Space Dingus Mach 2 to launch. Let's do some temperature. Quite literally nominal. Perfectly nominal. Everything is nominal. Except we might run out of fuel and I don't think this engine has enough. I don't know. Or wait, yeah. That's uh, that that's that that's not good. Well while we're up here. Poor old Jeb. It looks like he has the time of his life, but he doesn't know the one crucial thing. He might be accidentally sending him up into space. Yeah. There we go. Wait, did I go to get that one? Where did we lose the data? Okay. And true report. Boing. See you later, Rocket. Bye bye. Have a nice time. Man, we can see space. There's the moon. I hope to get there one day. And it looks like the rocket's going back down. Ooh, we're in orbit. We might be able to do an EVA real quick. Okay, get back in the ship then, you, you scaredy cat. Oh fuck, 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 what the fuck. Okay, we're coming back down. Hopefully it doesn't get too hot. Because we do not have any heat shield and more likely this thing will melt. Ah, no, we're doing fine. Good old Jeb right there is all happy as hell. Of course he is, the next time we an insane man. Yay, bear shoots out. We're ready, boys. It should have me during the Area 51 raid. I want to launch a rocket right into Area 51. Only like Mad Mike, that one guy that flew out there was trying to prove something, and he, he crashed here about a week ago. Yeah, that kind of dates the video now. But yeah, he's trying to prove the Earth was flat. The rocket just went, the parachute failed and was staged early, and it made the rocket just crash right into the damn ground. You can search up the video. Uh, somewhere on the internet, or like the uh, live leak. Okay, and... It's okay. Log the temp. And it's time for us to go home. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. 40 science, we might be able to do all this. Ooh, yeah, no, that's the sound of science being made. Let's do a Mach 3 now. The Space Dingus Mach 3. You know, we get rid of all this bullshit. Get rid of that. Right there. And just check my video thing. Let me have a landing here. Science. So we put that right there. 
Put those right there. Okay, maybe not that way. Maybe not this way. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, you know what? Not a bad idea. We'll just, we'll just put the, take that off. Put that right there. Don't worry your little heads off. This will not explode. Probably. It, it probably won't explode. Yeah, Adam. No. And uh, parachutes break here. Right there, yep. And he will be able to get out. And now it is time for the big rocket. Put a shit in the fuel tank right there. Right there. Put that right there. Get some of that. Mm. Boy, do I love this smell. Hydrogen peroxide and all that bullshit, man. Most of you guys have like, you known the ultra rockets, kind of use the amateur ones. But with those, ooh, this thing's starting to look like a rocket already. There we go, nose cones, winglets. Ooh, the space dingus is starting to look a lot over now. Wait, space dingus. Eh, right there. Save it. Now it is time to launch. It is time to save and launch. It is time. the face dingus to go into flight. Five, four, three, two, one. Space dingus left behind. So. Go wobbly right there, but do not worry. That'll be fine. Here, that'll be fine. We're only gonna go wrong. More than that. That means it's getting hot. How hot? Yeah, we're right around now. Almost 400 degrees Kelvin or something. I don't know. Oh. And? <laughs> See you later. Hopefully you don't come back and haunt me later. we're in well the space thing is mark three look at this majestic beast Ooh, you have a pretty good orbit all we have to do is just well i wouldn't risk it i don't have enough fuel Let's just do a quick subby. Some more if you're wondering. Let's do a spacewalk. 
Okay. Let's do a space walk. EBA. Oh boy. Open. Open sesame. Man. Love and smell science on the It's time for us to go home now. We've seen enough. Also, Jeb probably has to go pick up piss. In like, three minutes. Okay, and we are coming back in. Ah, shit, it looks like we're gonna crash and land. Not crash and land, but crash on land. Oh, bullshit. I'm coming in a little too hot. I don't think there's anything to bring up. Okay, Jim. Probably slow enough, and so those things will probably deploy. Blowing the rocket down. And then, yeah, that's not Jets in it. Nice. You could have put landing legs on it, but nah. Why the hell would you want to put landing legs in this sucker? I think the purpose of the, I think the mission for this episode would probably be getting into orbit. So, we're pretty close. Maybe we should end it by sending a rocket with a satellite into orbit. That's what shits and giggles. This will prove that we can because, you know, we're basically doing what the Russians did at this moment. Yep. All parachutes are deployed. I don't know if that's yes. We could get some repair shoots. Hmm, yes. And it's time to come home. Man, we have some fucking much. Is it trying to talk to our audience? No, no, I don't have big of audience yet. I mean, like, I know some of you get it personally, so that's pretty good. Ooh, 108. That one. Hmm. Do that one. And we'll shoot these three for the middle. Uh, let's go to the day. There we go. The next day. I think since we already got like all the temperature readings. I don't think we need all that, so. You know what? I need one. Don't save. That Sputnik. Mm. 
and do some next. We'll finally have our own Sputnik. Actually, I don't think we do a break right now. Let's say Stingus Mach 4. And then we'll end the episode by sending our first satellite into space. Somebody's starting to pick a rocket already. One of those. Too. Not that big one. I'm looking to actually get an orbital rocket, not some sort of expensive firework. Okay, and then I think we need to launch a sucker. Yeah, we can launch. So, yeah. Here we go. It was a little wobbly. Well, it is space dangerous. Ooh, 
right there. Okay, so all of those are all used up. And let me check. Ooh, we're getting a good view. Perfect, so hold it. Yeah, we'll fix it. My pair. And now we're in space. This day. Let's see what we need here. Let's see it. Let's go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. I completely forgot. Stay up here for some point in time. Let's stay up here for a day. Stay up here for two days. Not what I wanted, but sure. You say I'm to come home. Time for the deorbit burn, and we'll be coming home. I'm gonna try to land in the daylight. I have to land in the Spaceship while you lasted. Yeah, look at that daylight. Okay, well, we're landing on land, so that's a little better. something important. Oh, okay, so we can judge on the heat shield. There we go. See you later, heat shield. Yeah, it's gonna hit the mountain, isn't it? So, after this, I think we might be able to launch our first satellite in orbit, and while we're doing, while you guys wait for the second episode, I think I'll work in this a little bit more, so it won't be so boring. I'm trying to get, like, docking ports and all that, and try to upgrade, and maybe we'll land in the moon for the next episode, I don't know. I'm trying to dock. Mm hmm 
but I know this seemed kind of boring, but it's something that I really like and enjoy. Bada boom, and we recover the vessel. Yeah, the dingy. Wait, where? Where would it actually be? Wait. I have to research that. Whatever. So, oh god, what's here? I will to say like in my free time, and I guess next episode we'll try to land on the moon. So until then, good night, good luck. And why don't you go fuck yourselves? <laughs>